Um, hey guys, this is Super Fortune Cookie here, guys, with another League of Legends Champion Spotlight with the newest champion of the league that just came out um, not too long ago. I already bought her because she is so good and so overpowered that I just know I had to get her. So, I'm talking about Quinn. Yes, Damasia's Wing is the newest champion. Only one skin, but that's just fine. Phoenix Quinn, that's the skin. And it costs 975 riot points. She also costs 975 riot points. But for a limited time, you can get her um, her bundle. But that's not going to last too much longer. So rush to the store and get it. Okay. Um. Yeah. Um. All right. Let's just go. Uh, what I play her as is I play her as the AD carry. She um is ranged and she's an AD carry and she's pretty overpowered and everybody's playing her in ranked well not everybody but most of the people so let's just go over her abilities real quick uh, her passive is Harrier uh, Valor periodically marks enemies as vulnerable Quinn's uh, first basic attack against vulnerable targets will deal bonus physical damage and if you guys didn't know Quinn is the actual character the like human and Valor is the bird at first I thought it was the other way around but no okay and yeah so Harrier is really important uh, skill or passive because it does most of your damage um, blinding assault that is uh, her Q that's what I take first and that's what I max first uh, uh, Quinn calls Valor to blind and damage targets in an area um, yeah in a skill shot nuke which is pretty awesome heightened senses is a um, Pretty interesting one. I maxed this one last. Not very important, but it is pretty good. Uh, passively grants Quinn attack speed after she attacks a vulnerable target. Valor's attack speed is permanently increased. Activate to have Valor reveal a large area nearby. So let's show that again just so you can see what it does. It's kind of like an ash uh, crystal arrow that, or whatever it's called, the arrow that shows. Um, an enemy when you fire it. Alright, uh, I take that last, by the way. I max the last. Uh, Vault, uh, her E. This is what I take, this is why I max second. Um, Quinn dashes to an enemy, dealing physical damage and slowing the target's movement speed. Upon reaching the target, she leaps off and lands near her maximum attack range from it, and she will immediately mark this enemy as vulnerable. So, a good combo is E, Q, and then, like, her E basic attack Q or E Q basic attack. Either one of those is really good. Um, and then you can finish it off with your ultimate which is called tag team. Valor replaces Quinn on the battlefield as a mobile melee attacker um, with massive movement speed. And when ready Quinn returns in a hail of arrows dealing physical damage. I'll, I'll show you. Uh, so see she turns into her bird thingy and then when the ability is over she comes back down in arrows. Yes. So that is, yeah, that's basically uh, her ability. So I max Q, E, R, W. Uh, that's the order. And yeah, tips, uh, nothing really important there. Yeah. Alright. And now masteries. Or I'll, yeah, I'll go masteries first because masteries. Alright, I just. 80 carry. That's what I take. Um, and basically you go four, four, one, three, two, two, three, one, one. Um, so four fury, four deadliness, one weapon expertise, three havoc, two lethality, two brute force, one frenzy, three sunder, or sunder, and one executioner. Um, and one summoner's revolve, three hardiness, four durability, and one veteran scar. So that's twenty one nine zero. Or you can build her as a, uh, actually that's about it. Um, she might be a okay support. I haven't really seen anybody play her as a support yet, but this would be the support mm -hmm. masteries if you were going to play her. Or maybe even jungle would be good. And if you were going to play her as a jungle, there it is, 2190, but with a little bit different masteries. Alright, for runes I take uh, armor, armor yellows. Magic resist blues, uh, attack damage reds, and attack damage quintessences, or you could take armor pen reds instead of just attack damage red. Depends on what you want to do. And, um, 
Yeah, I think that might be it. Um, do you want like stuff in the box? Yeah, so let's like just so I can make a custom match here. Create game. And just create a game. We're not going to play against anybody, so I'm just going to start game. Yes. Just to show you, like, my item preferences on it. Open. Um, we get cleanse flash and we get ADC and we get AD. Alright. <clears throat> no. There we go. Alright, so yeah, Quinn is very high mobility with her ultimate and um deals large burst of damage uh fairly quickly. Yeah, come on. And then load up. Um, does this all the time. Um, there we go. All right. So yeah, it's um pretty good. I mean, I really like her. I've been using her a lot, and she's she's really a great addition to the game. I think because just her ranged like crazy combos that she has her slow with her vault it's just amazing and you can get lots of really quick pills too which is pretty good so right, it's loading pretty fast and come on faster load faster almost there and alright there we go so it's gonna lag obviously in the beginning. Like, see, look at lag. Like crazy. Alright, there we go. Now it's not lagging as bad, but still pretty laggy. Uh, take your Q first. Grab. And, um. I wouldn't recommend boots on Quinn. I mean, it's okay to get boots, but she's fast enough. Like,. Her movement speed, base, movement speed, I don't quite know what it is, wait a second. Um, uh, I don't know what her base movement speed is. Oh, it's 335 units per second, that's how much you can move. So boots might be good help, but I start off with door doing. But get boots if you're going to get boots, and if you're going to get boots, get either Berserker Greed for attack speed, uh, if you're playing against a lot of AD heavy team, go Ninja Tabby, and if there's a lot of CC on their team, go Merc Treads. Um, other than that, for core item build, I would build Bloodthirster, Static Shiv, Last Whisperer, Infinity Edge, Phantom Dancer, Frozen Mallet. Um, and if you need extra tankiness, I would get Black Cleaver or Warmogs, possible, poss possibly Randuins, but... Mostly warm mobs or black cleaver. Frozen mouth's really, really important on Quinn. Like that's the first major item you should build on her is frozen mallet. And uh, yeah, let's just do some real quick. I just want to show you um some standard combos with this chick. So I'm just gonna head down here. Yeah. Um, okay. Yeah. Don't lag that much, come on. Man. Don't lag, don't lag. All right, here we go. So it is a skill shot. Um, I'm just gonna show you. See, kind of just shoots him out like that. Okay. Just so I can get to lane faster, and this isn't actually a really match. So really, you just gotta shoot your thingy. You just gotta last it. Like, yeah, I'm like wicked crazily. Um, see, so basically, shoot your. I'm not getting any of assets because I'm lying really bad. Um, but then you can. That was crazy delay right there. I don't think I'll be able to even show you my combo, but I'm just trying to level up. Okay, so this is the combo. If I stop lagging, I will do it. Alright, so you do. You bounce off, and then you throw your thing like, right after it. And that's basically your combo open. So, uh, thank you guys for watching this video, uh, this, uh, video for Quinn, Champion Spotlight. Please check out my other Champion Spotlights and other videos and stuff like that. And thank you guys for watching. And goodbye.